So we're here today to highlight some of our students with special needs who participate in STAR. Um, this is our bowling competition and so we are, we've been practicing for three weeks and this is a culmination of our celebration for them to compete against each other. So it's all of our middle school campuses across the district. I'm here to help the EA kids bowl today. I love to hang out with these kids because they always put a smile on my face. I help the kids come together and create bonds and just learn the skill of bowling and they just they just love it. It, it hypes them up and they just builds their character and stuff. It's awesome. Last week we had our Star High School bowling competition and we had over a hundred volunteers throughout that month of practice leading up to the competition and they were volunteers from various organizations, our facts, our pals. Um, all the student-led organizations from our high schools. It was really good to see them out there interacting with their peers. Uh, they weren't just standing around with their hands in their pockets. They were out there on, the, on the, the alley helping them with the balls, cheering for them, being very enthusiastic. I couldn't have asked for anything more. So at first, like you, you don't really understand why you're here, like, like what your purpose is, like how to help them and such. But after coming for so long, you realize that you're helping them create the bonds that like, they can carry with them into the future of meeting new people, becoming more social, and just like not being afraid to let themselves be themselves. Like not be afraid to be themselves. I think some of the things I get out of it are just, first of all, just learning sportsmanship. Some of our kids have a hard time um, losing, not doing their, you know, not, not doing what exactly what they want to happen. And um, so this really does help them build their, build up that ability to um, lose gracefully, accept things that come, come to them that they don't necessarily like. You know, they learn that like, hey, it's not that big of a deal. And we can generalize those skills into the classroom. So win or loss, they're going to have a good attitude by the end of the tournament. So I find myself smiling way more during the day. They just love being out and they love feeling like they're a part of something that you know, special and, um, and that they're an athlete, you know, so that's, that's really neat. It teaches me to be appreciative of what you have and to really learn to like respect others because you never know who, what could be going through or what circumstance someone could be in. So just respect everybody, it's not that difficult.